One of the most effective ways to increase physical activity is to engage in collaborative and competitive exercise. But people with disabilities often face a number of barriers, like poorly designed equipment and limits to transportation, that prevent them from these types of activities. We seek to develop an advanced virtual environment exercise device called AVID that provides opportunities for people with disabilities to engage in shared activity. We will incorporate five unique innovations in this project to utilize readily available GPS-enabled video cameras to easily create content, enable a shared virtual exercise experience, add realistic resistance to inputs based on changes in virtual terrain, add more natural user interface capability, and enable real-time performance monitoring. Our ultimate goal is to increase exercise enjoyment and participation for people with disabilities. Here is an example of key precedent research in virtual environments being navigated by exercise inputs. Here is an example of a very successful mass production exercise bike that includes resistance control linked to Google Maps. Here are examples of extremely well-designed exercise systems for both upper and lower body inputs with highly refined ergonomics. This is an example of video gamers playing the latest interactive games with their remote friends. What if all of these elements could be integrated into a single platform? What if this platform was modular and could be optimized for a wide range of user needs? We have assembled a team of exercise physiologists, therapists, engineers, and design experts to take these types of leading concepts and apply them in a highly innovative combination to create a sophisticated design that is adaptable to the users who need this technology most. We've even included asymmetric force inputs for users who may have only partial use of one side of their body. In conclusion, the AVID project has the potential to become a modular platform and a truly universal design for users seeking improved tools. Because the universal market is much larger in size, we believe there may be significant opportunities for corporate backing. Through larger potential sales volumes, the quality of devices for the disabled community will be much higher and the cost could become much more affordable, resulting in significantly greater use.